that you need direction in today's reality. You understand? Because there are moments of love and light. There are also moments of darkness and disappointment. Do you understand? And as I said, from the beginning of my journey, sharing with you as a collective, I've coined, I said, I've coined the fruit. Of the universe is balance. And so, in my sharing, you will get moments of encouragement. You will get moments of redirection. You will get Understanding of discernment. Lots of messages, lots of messages. The next message is your angels are proud of you and urge you to be more diligent to get impressive life results. Pray to God to ignite more. Okay? Pray to God to ignite more. Next card. Go now. That's telling me someone needs to move from one extreme to another extreme. And that is confirmation. I'm being told to tell you, you know you who you are. I said, you know who you are. That is confirmation. The message that I'm receiving now is when it comes to relationships, you have a very happy and steady connection with someone you love. Wow, that's interesting. (laughs) It says, when it comes to relationships, you have a very happy and steady connection with someone you love. I guess that is a moment of (laughs) self-disclosure. I believe that is what is being called. And so people, when you obey, and as the guard, the card says, go now. God opens the door of blessings. And this is why today I am happy. Today. I feel fulfilled. Today, I am loved the way I want to be loved. Today, I 
I am very happy because I have a steady connection with someone I love. And that is what God can do for you. I said that is what God can do for you. But are you ready to take the first step? Are you ready to go now? Huh? Are you ready to go to your north node? Question. Those of you that are in delusion, that you don't have a compass, and that you don't know where to go, you need a compass. Ask God. God is your compass. I said God is your compass. Wow. The last card was go now. And this card says prosperity. There is a positive shift in your flow of divine support. See, when you go now, you arrive to a positive shift in your flow of divine support. You ready to go now? I said, are you ready to go now? And what I love about this card that says go now. There is light. You will be given light. Light that surpasses your understanding. Light, the energy of light, the embodiment of light, the feeling of light. What I love about the prosperity card Is wow, I never paid attention to this because it's so small, but it appears to be a globe, and it appears to be a view looking down. Not someone looking down, but the view that I'm seeing in this card, it's as if I'm in a direction that's looking down and I'm seeing angels that are so small on this card, but angels that are surrounding The earth. Shining light. As light shines out of them. They're shining light. They're shining. The areas. Of the earth. That are green. That represent 
prosperity. They're shining light on parts of the earth that represent blue. That represents healing. I'm being led to tell you you're being called to shine your light. You're being called to shine your light. Next card. We seem to get reminded a lot about this card. And because that is the case, it's telling me that something collectively we need to continue to work on. Make time for self-care. Taking care of yourself is essential right now. Yes. Those of you that are on a journey in a new direction, going to a new extreme, part of fortifying yourself in order to achieve your goal ahead is self-care. Get enough sleep, get enough rest. And I say it this way because sleep is sleep, rest is rest. Do you understand? Sometimes rest is just taking a moment to pause. Just pause and do nothing. And sleep is closing your eyes, surrendering, allowing God. To look over you. As you just close your eyes. And believe. Being encouraged to share this next message with you. Take time to see the points of view of those you may have been, you may be challenged by at this time. Call on the angels of harmony to ease any challenge in relationships. Let me repeat that. It reads, take time to see the points of view of those you may be challenged by at this time. Call on the angels of harmony to ease any challenging relationships. Did you know you could do that? Did you know you could call the angels of harmony to ease those relationships that are in need for harmony? The message I'm being led to share is people who love to spend time with friends and have fun with them.